Hello students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting video, I would like to tell you something. Please sit with copy pen. If you find somewhere important, pause the video, note it and proceed on. If you find somewhere difficulty, then please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you once again. Now here is the question. Two identical point masses, each of mass M, are connected to one another by a massless string of length capital L. A constant force F is applied at the midpoint of the string if small l be the instantaneous distance between the two masses that will be the acceleration of each mass. In this question, we have given two identical point masses which having the masses M, which is connected with a string, light string, it means there is no mass considered. And when it is pulled, some force is applied exactly midpoint of this string. Okay, and this whole system is kept on the table. It means very simple, there is no any gravitational force is applied, means it is a friction base. And when just we have to pull out or we have to apply the force, then it comes to closer. It means they are come to closer that we having some acceleration and we have to calculate that acceleration okay so whenever we have to pull out like this this l become l by 2 l by 2 and at instantaneous position the distance between the like that we have considered suppose this object come to closer and the distance become l so exactly at midpoint the distance become l by 2 is it clear so here tension is applied let us consider this angle is theta so resolving two components that is separately we have data draw separately let us consider theta so here this is t cos theta and this is t sin theta okay and this is the force <coughs> and same things applied <coughs> at the b point here again T sin theta and here T cos theta. Okay. Is it clear now? So here this force which is we have to apply this F is equal to 2T sin theta. Okay. Let's consider it is the first equation. Now here this T cos theta. Here T cos theta that is the force tension force is applied in this direction. This is equal to mass into acceleration okay so rearranging ma can be written as t cos theta it is second equation now first divided by second first divided by second then f by ma equal to 2t sin theta upon t cos theta t t cancel out then f upon ma equal to 2 tan theta then it can be written as f by this 2 transposing into the left side in denominator 2m and this is tan theta and this a goes to the in transposing and right side comes in numerator okay so f by 2m tan theta equal to a and then it can be written as <coughs> It can be written as A equal to F by 2M. 1 by 10 theta can be written as cot theta. Okay. And now what is the cot theta? Here the base and this is altitude. Now substitute this value. Now before substitution, we have find out the altitude. Here this distance is L by 2. This is theta. This is perpendicular. And this distance is L by 2. Then uh, by using Pythagoras theorem, L by 2 square is equal to perpendicular square and it is base square. So L square by 4 minus small L square by 4 equal to P square. Then it can be written as P equal to root capital L square small L square upon 2. Okay, so it is perpendicular. Now what is the value of cot theta? Cot theta equal to base upon perpendicular. What is base? L by 2. And what is perpendicular here? L square minus 
minus small n square upon 2. Here 2, 2 cancel out, then acceleration equal to f small l 2m root capital L square minus L square. So here the acceleration of this point mass. Okay. I hope so. You understood this question. Thank you for staying till the end of this video. Definitely, when you will become success, whole contribution goes to your hard work. But if my videos, my lectures, my questions will help in your success, I will consider myself lucky. Please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you once again. Take care. Bye-bye.